hili ni process ilikuwa ngumu mm. because sasa after nimepeleka hospitali mm-hmm. nimefanya operation mm. siku ya kwanza mm-hmm. siku ya pili mm-hmm. mzee wangu akakuja kuniona hospitali Mm-hmm. Mhm. So, mm, ikakuwa nilistuka. Mm. Nasikia hizi hizi ni kama ni sayo ni nashona. Sasa mm. nasikia because siku tarajia ni mbele wa sira. Mhm. But wakati nilimuongelea, mm-hmm. nilisikia mtoto akilia kwa baki. Mhm. So I was like ako wapi hapa mtoto analia? Mhm. Now in fact the sixth sense mm, is very, very powerful. Kwanza hiyo inakuanga sana sana na wamama. Yes. So, we have a sixth sense. Nikakuwa na question mark. Mm. Na the way alinirudisha haikuwa mm. ile ya oh they something ya hapa. Mhm. So hiyo siku ikaisha kukuja. Mhm. Siku ya pili akukuja mm-hmm. mm-hmm. just kwa mm-hmm. mm-hmm. So bila kukuja siku ya tatu alikuwa amekasirika hapo anakuwa. Mhm. Oi kem hata kukusalimia hakuna nini na nilikwenda kunipigia masimu leta hiyo makaratasi nilipo uende nyumbani that's what he did three days in the hospital this man comes and he starts shouting at you mm. oh god so kukufanya kitu hiyo mm. sikuweza kutembea nilikuwa nashikilia yeah, kwa mbona kwa mbona kwa mbona mm. akatukua hizo akaenda clear the bills mm-hmm. kwa nyumbani mm. so kwenda nyumbani Mhm. Nikarara siku moja. Mhm. Siku ya pili simu yangu. Mm-hmm. Simu yake ilikuwa na shida sana. Mhm. Akaniomba simu yangu. Mm-hmm. So simu zilikuwa kitamu zile za Nokia. Mhm. So wakati aliniomba hii simu yangu nikapatia because mimi nilikuwa kwa nyumba nilikuwa. Mm-hmm. So wakati alienda na ile simu yangu. Mhm. Kaka naye bezoite. Simu Mhm. So I was like who is this person mwenye mm-hmm. ameandikwa hani na ametumiwa this 40k baadhi. Mm-hmm. Si kufanya kitu chochote. Mm-hmm. Sasa so, nilikuwa very weak. Nilita mm-hmm. mzee wangu. Mhm. Kama ndio. Kwa sure ni pesa yangu. Umetumia the whole day. Mm-hmm. Na wakati umechat hizi messages zote mm-hmm. za upendo sijui nini. Kwa nini umeniletea singe delete tu? Mm-hmm. Na unaona mimi ni mgonjwa. Nawaambia mm-hmm. You are fat me. Mm. Umeni umeza. Mm. Usa hiyo niliona hizo message. Unaweza imagine isile usi vile sinakupula. The pain. I understand. Ukwe alitukua simu. Na mm. wakati ya liangalia kifu. Mm-hmm. Aliyambia mzo. Mm-hmm. Kwa mzo. Yeah, Yeni after wewe kuona. Unamanisha kwa mba wewe usinge ona. Ata asinge kwa projecti. Asinge kwa ata. Mm. But I think in God. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So. Hiyo kitu ilileta issue. Mhm. Wewe ni siku ya pili nimetoka hospitali. Mm-hmm. Ninafaa tu leso mm-hmm. na chini. Mhm. Ilileta issue. Mhm. 
So, mimi kitu ni mfani, mm -hmm. nilitukua hile namba. Ya, sinuana kumerudishana, hile namba sasa yenye litumiwa pesa. Mm -hmm. Siku kwa simu yangu, mm -hmm. I called that number. Mm -hmm. When I called this number, it mm -hmm. was already. Mm -hmm. Na uyo, mwanamuke, hile ni kia simu yuka muta abari ya kutema mbuo. Mm -hmm. It broke my heart. Yani, it broke my heart. Mm. Ile usi sika nikula kabisa nikasikia kama ndiyo nakato. Mm. So I'm like, my God, who is this? Simujui ananitua mpaka that much. Anaiza nitua this much. Mm. Na iyo ndiyo kitu nikona protect. Mm. Nisi, nisi jurikane iyo. Mm. I think, I thank God. Mungu aliweza kunipatia nguvu because I was very weak. Mm. Iyo usiku mze wangu tukagombana na hii mbaka around sa sita usiku. Mm. And he told me, you have to get out of my house. Yes. You call your mother, you call your people. Mm. Kutukue. Ama sivu ni kutupe kwa tiricha utoke kundi. And you have not fully healed. Hiyo ni siku ya pili ni metoka usikitari. How inhuman was this? Women go through a lot of things. So much. And ukiwa hapo nje na umesikia kama vile hele na anavu elezea. Usidhani ya kompa ukopeke yako. Be free. Talk free. Actually, a problem shared is half solved. So, with our uh, story today, Usichoke, you can get us. We will give you a number, a permission. At least you have now known that Kunawatu and India to bring sana. And your situation does not justify what action you will take because most people always take very bad actions. I thank God because today we have Helen here to testify for us and for her to stand and testify for us, it means she stood strong somewhere. Helen, I just needed you to have some time or relax so that we embark to the story.